Hey guys, it's Josh Buckin here from HMO Customer Racing. It's my second year in the category, and I'm here to give you a little bit of an insight for newbies as to what is TCR. So what is TCR? Well, TCR stands for Touring Car Racing. It's basically a global category that competes in over 30 countries across the world, European, Asian, and World Championships. And the cars we use out here are the same as what you'll find all around the world. They're basically a road base, road car base, taken to factories and then turned into total race cars. They never have a VIN number or anything like that. They're a race car from birth, effectively. Lots of carbon fiber bits on them. Engine is still exactly what you'll find in the road car bar, a few little bits and pieces, but uh, they are full-blown race cars, let me assure you. So what are the cars? Well, the cars are front-wheel drive, obviously. All the cars in the category are front-wheel drive. There's a cap on being a maximum of two litres, which our car is, and they have to be four-cylinder turbo drive. So they usually produce about 360 horsepower, give or take, depending on the BOP. Uh, and there is a set BOP as well, with different weights, ride heights, and all sorts of things to try and match us all together to create similar lap times so that throughout the year, it's not just one team winning, it's multiple teams winning. So how many races are there in 2022? Well, there's seven this year. So we go all the way from Tasmania in a few weeks time, right at the bottom of the country, so all the way up to Queensland, Queensland Raceway for wild rounds, Sydney in between, and also Bathurst twice. Yeah. How does a race weekend work? So basically, I rock up on usually the Thursday with a coffee in my hand. It's very, very easy on the Thursday for me. Business starts for us on Friday after all the boys have uh, set the pits and the truck and the uh, bays up for us. Work begins on Friday with a couple of practice sessions. Moving on to Saturday, we have a qualifying session and a race, which determines obviously the grid order. And then race one determines your grid spot for race two, which is on the Sunday, along with race three, which has more points than the first two races. And then those three together decide who wins. So how can you follow TCR through the year? Well, it's very simple. We're on Stan Sport exclusively this year in a new exciting deal. And on the TCR Australia page, you can keep updates and also end performance in Australia. Right now, they will be posting all of the content you have to catch.